everyone, my name is Julie, and if you're new to my channel, I have four children. Um, my two boys are six and three, and my two girls are four and one. And today I'm gonna to show you what we've got, what we've chosen for our boys' stockings this year, for their stocking stuffers. Next week I'm gonna do our girls' stocking stuffers, so make sure you come back next week. Subscribe to my channel if you're not, and come back next week to see what's in my girls' stockings. Um, but let's get started with what is in my boys' stockings this Christmas. So we do spend a good amount on their stockings, but we get a lot of necessities. So our stockings are not just, um, toys and games, um, we do get a lot of their necessities. So we get their shampoo, their toothbrushes, their a lot of stuff at Christmas, um, and then it lasts them for the next year. So um, we did get them both some socks. I'm looking at them now seeing that we got Elijah. Elijah's my six-year-old, Simeon's my three-year-old. So it looks like we got Elijah four pairs of socks and we got Simeon six pairs of socks, which is good because he is like almost out of socks. Um, then we did get them both as well. I'm like looking through my bag. I have a huge Walmart bag. <laughs> and all my stuff's in here. So, um, there is one set of toothbrushes. We got them both a set of toothbrushes. And the other one is in here somewhere and I don't know where. I'm sure I'll come to it. So Elijah, we got Angry Birds. No, Simeon, we got Angry Birds toothbrushes. Elijah's our Star Wars. Um, we also got them both undershirts. I start shopping so early and when I see a good deal, I buy some undershirts. Whoops, found an extra little piece of garbage here. And as I was sorting all of the stuffers, stocking stuffers to put in this bag, I realized that we got um, Elijah two packages of undershirts and Simeon one package. But that's okay, I think I bought one package early and then I bought two more. Anyway, that's that. And then we also got them both a new toque winter hat these are like I don't know they always lose them or one's wet and they need another one so I like to have a few hats for them um, we got Elijah a new water bottle he's had the one he has for a long time and it's really getting worn out so we got him a new one. Oh, Star Wars toothbrushes there they are we got Elijah a new baseball glove um, yeah his one from last year I don't remember the story. Um, my husband picked this one up. I think he changed hands or something. I don't know, he needed a new one. So um, there's his glove. We got Simeon, just a simple Nerf football. Um, and then for Elijah, we got him these two guides. They're called stick bots. I'd never heard of them before um, shopping this Christmas, but he loves just holding little guys. And so I thought these looked pretty cool. It says on them, you create, you animate, you share. Apparently there's a StickBot app that you can use and share their different poses, I don't know, which he won't do, but I know he'll like to use these guys and bend them all around. Um, and then for Simeon, for his little toy, we got him all the Paw Patrol guys, so not all of them. Um, I think there's a couple we didn't get, but we got him most of them. We got him um, Rocky, or Rubble, Rocky. Um, he already has Zuma, so we got him Marshall and Chase. And then we got a Simeon, a little kazoo. We thought he'd really like that, just a wooden Melissa and Doug kazoo. And we also got Simeon a Paw Patrol shirt. He loves Paw Patrol, as you can see. And then we got Simeon, or sorry, Elijah, this little you fidget. He loves to fidget and so I thought he would like this even just to hold on and play with seriously we homeschool and while he is uh, doing his reading I've started to just pass him something and be like hold this because I don't know what it is he's sitting there reading a book to me and he's like pulling on my arm or he's just like pulling on his pants or like kicking my feet like he's just so fidgety and sometimes I'm like just focus and read but so I figured out if I give him something to hold he'll kind of play with that so, I don't know, whatever. But I thought he would uh, like to have this little thing. It looks like you can make lots of cool shapes with it. So, I saw that and knew he would like it. And then we got them, I'm not sure whose stocking will put these in, but either way they'll both share them. So, we'll probably give Simeon the Paw Patrol shampoo and then this is toothpaste I'll probably put into Elijah's. And actually all the kids will share this toothpaste, but. Um, and then other than that, I, we did buy them um, new mitts, gloves, for uh, 
winter, winter gloves. And they each have a nice pair of mitts, like the nice uh, warm, like playing in snow mitts. But I like to get them a whole bunch of those little pairs of um, just simple uh, gloves that they can wear just when we're going out to the store, just to keep their hands warm. So um, I could not find them in the store. I don't know why I could not find just simple uh, gloves. I always get confused between gloves and mittens. Just a simple pair of gloves. So we actually ordered them each a couple of pairs online and they're not here yet, but they should be here hopefully before Christmas. Um, and then I also got some more stocking stuffers for Elijah that won't fit in his stocking. So I'm not sure if I'm going to um, just leave these laying out beside his stocking. We do that sometimes if we have overflow or if I'm gonna wrap them up and put them, make them as a tree gift instead. I'm not sure, but anyways, we got this. Um, what does it say there, button up bear? Um, and my plan was to give this to Elijah. I probably still will, because he loves doing stuff like this. Some, see with the, I don't know, he's very, um, he loves, like if he has a string, he loves to like tie little knots or like tie it around his stuffed animals and he just loves, I don't even know how to describe it, but like, I don't know, <laughs> like tying up things, just like little puzzle type things. Anyway, so I thought maybe he would like this, but now that I'm looking at all these, ex these extra stocking stuffers that are going to be overflow, I don't really have overflow for Simeon, so I might give it to Simeon and he'll enjoy it too and then they'll take turns. I don't know. I haven't decided, but anyway. A little lace up there. And then we got, this is for Elijah, a uh, little reader. It's a level one reader. Even level one readers, I'm, some of them are a little bit, I think it's going to be a little bit of a challenge for Elijah, but I can't wait till he can read more of these books. And so this one I think is a fairly simple one he'll be able to read soon. And then we also got Elijah, he loves his arts and crafts, and we got him this little, the picture is going to be that, but he has to get all the stickers and stick them on the right number and um, make the picture. So. That is all their stocking stuffers. I think that's it. Other than treats, we went and got them. We usually get them too many treats. I find we get them for them, and then they have a few the day of Christmas and a few the day after, the few days after, and then they forget about them, and we are just stuck with a bunch of chocolate and candy in our cupboard that takes them a long time to eat. So I tried to get them less this year, but I got a package of candy canes, a package of little chocolates, um, a little case of Smarties. And then, oh, one of those books with lifesavers. I think that's it for their, their candy and treats this year. But anyways, those are the stocking stuffers for our boys. Maybe that gave you some ideas for what you can put in your boys' stockings. Come back and check out my video next week where I will be showing you all of my girls' stocking stuffers. So thank you for watching this video, and I will see you next week. Bye!